real got a boxing man i'm just uh touching base reacting to uh patrick alote unfortunate event a bad mistake at the uh one of the ghana premier premier league games go uh it was a football uh, soccer game where he uh got in a confrontation with a man it was going back and forth and so he struck the guy guy with a right hand so Here's the thing, man. Everybody make mistakes, right? Uh, th these, this is this is a message to you, shock jock radio host in Ghana, and uh, you shock jock host that's just looking to break a story. So-called media people that's just trying to break a story, you know, you know, you, you, you gotta take into account the man's overall character. Uh, Patrick Alote, he's a nice guy, quiet guy. You know, he made a mistake. You know, let's think about helping him. Like, let's think about, you know, this this thing called CTE. You know, like it really. Uh, is related to people who take a lot of head blows or even football, uh, American football more so. But if boxing is a concussive sport, you know, you're, you're being, your brain is being concussed. So we don't know what's going on. Not saying that, giving an excuse or anything, but I'm just basically saying, you know, instead of trying to persecute the person, you know, you may want to look more into it, you know. But it was a mistake. That's the, it was a bad mistake. And if you take into account the man's character, you know, you're not going to want to persecute. You, you're going to, it's not i hear all these people on radio ghana radio talk about throw the book at them persecute them make an example because of the uh you know that they're, they're thinking about that event yeah the main ninth uh across sports stadium disaster in 2001 and 126 people were crushed you know we all know the story and that's what's in the back of a lot of people's minds you know uh, the the main ninth across sports disaster that's in the back of people's minds so the, everything they relate in in any you know any confrontation or something like this you know, stop fueling something that's a small mistake, that's a mistake. He's going to pay for his mistakes, maybe via uh, what they call uh, public service, you know. You know, you know whatever the penalty is, but you can't throw the book at a man when you look at his overall character. And, there's no, and his history doesn't show violent behavior, you know, on regular citizens, you know what I'm saying? Or he, he doesn't have a criminal history. This man is representing Ghana in boxing. He went all the way to the U.S., to represent Ghana with little support, little to no support. Only talk about football. You you, you shock jock hosts that don't even respect boxing. When the boxers there are bringing the most championships, you know these kids are fighting their way out of the out of poverty, and they make it to the big stage and they represent with no support. It was a mistake. I'm just saying, you shock jock folks. You shock jock. They call it shock jock radio hosts looking just to break a story. Don't even follow boxing. Don't even give it the respect. You only want to respect football, and you want to feel this on this man, Patrick Alote. You want to feel some hatred towards him. What kind of what kind of what kind of a uh, resolution is that? You know, the resolution is to seek help, get ask for. Maybe he needs help in some form or fashion. I'm thinking is he reacted due to frustration with his promoters for various reasons. You know, uh, I'm not gonna even get into that, but you know, you just don't know what people are going through, but. If he can pay for his mistakes, when you take into account his overall character, he's not a bad guy. And if he apologized and helped his, you know, pay restitution, maybe he have to pay this this kid that he hit. Maybe he has to help him in some ways to re recover. It's all about recovery. It's all about positive energy, help. You know, you take the bad and you turn it into a good. And you, you shouldn't get on radio and be a shock jock host and just try to be, uh, come down on somebody you don't even know about. Don't follow boxing. Uh, Patrick Alote. He he needs to respect people as well. He will pay for his he will pay, you know, for his his misfortune. But like I said, uh, you, you you talking about throwing a book, prosecuting to the fullest extent, like that's not how it works, man. You, you look at the person character, you look at the history, and you have len it's called lenience. You have towards somebody who doesn't have that in their history. Everybody can can make a mistake, okay. And I know he's a boxer and I know all this and it's a hard lesson. So I'm just saying, you people stop feeling, you, you, you radio jock, shock jock. We call him shock jock. Just looking to break a story. He needs to stop feeling stuff like this. You stop feeling it. Stop, stop, you know, you know, you don't cover boxing. So you don't know what these guys going through mentally. You don't even know if it could be CTE. You don't need CTE. Look it up. You don't know what it is. Look it up. You know, look it up. Stop being a uh, stop being a, a first to break the story. You know that's that's what this world has come to. Oh, I just want to break the story first. You know you you have some respect and look more into it. It's not just 
you know, you breaking a story, you you demeaning a guy, you know. Yeah, you 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 say it was a mistake and move forward, man. Stop stop with the persecution, man. It's real kind of boxing. And uh shout out and respect to the guy who who took the blow. I'm not gonna mention his name, but hopefully he recovers and these guys can come together for a resolution. This is about positive resolution, not persecuting the man. You know, he, he made his mistake. Get over it. Let's work towards a resolution, man. It's real kind of boxing. Thank <laughs> you.